Hi Puddins! It is your girl Glitter Mama here and today it is that time of the month where we just jump in and see what my favorites are. Um, so yeah, let's just get into it because like there's so much to like cover. So the first thing I want to talk about is this little miniature blush and bronzer palette from that I got through one of my subscription box from Coastal Scents. This is the shade right here. And it looks kind of like that. The real reason I love it is because of this blush, girl. Like, look at that. And I'm wearing it today. Like, can you see that? Like, it is gorgeous. It's kind of like, it's not a peach. It's, it's just a really nice pinky, kind of corally kind of color, if you would say that. Next is a highlight that I am flipping obsessed with I don't know I now that I'm thinking of it I think I might have whole I think I might have showed you guys this in my last month's uh favorites I'm not really sure but I'm gonna show it to you again so if you don't want to see it again you can just totally like skip over this part and just go to the next um and this is the um the in the color pink and it's the Shimmer from e.l.f. I think I got this at the Dollar Tree. I'm not really 100% sure. I've had this forever. Look at that highlight, guys. And that's just on my finger. Now look at it as a swatch. Like, and I'm wearing it like... That's, I mean, like, I'm wearing it as a highlight. Another thing that I got this month that I... Kind of, it's a sample size. But I am going to try and order this. This is um from Laura Mercier. I think I'm saying that right. <laughs> Um, and this is the Rose Gold Caviar Eye Stick, or Caviar Stick Eye Color. I wore just this with eyeliner and mascara one day at work, and it didn't feel like I was wearing anything at all. And it looks so gorgeous, so amazing. Let me just swatch it for you. So pretty. This is it right here. I don't know if you can see it or not. Like, can you see that? Oh my god, like... It's pretty, like, in real life, it is so gorgeous and pretty, like, I just obsessed with this guy. Like, I've worn it, like, a few times at work, and then I sometimes will put it, like, on top, like, in the middle of, like, an eye color, and it just makes everything just bam. The next thing that I have is this foundation from L'Oreal. It's the True Match. I've, I've heard, like, other YouTubers on here, you know, talk about it, and they love it, and they swear up and down it. There's, like, every color skin color skin tone you can ever imagine in this particular um foundation um i just ended up getting uh, c1 if you're interested in what i what i got but this is kind of like a semi like very light foundation but it, i feel like it covers a lot of imperfections of mine um and i i love thing is this is a sample size it's really tiny, but this is the professional, um, I guess is a primer. Um, this is a primer, I guess. Um, I put this under my makeup, um, and like my skin, like one day my, my, my face was a little bit, bit drier than usual. Um, which that never ever happens because I'm very, very oily, but I was like, you know what? I'm going to use this because it is a little dry because of the weather and like we're, we're ha right around my house, not literally around my house, but like my, my area where I live, there's been a bunch of wildfires. So the smoke and everything has just been drying out my skin, but this stuff has been helping out. Um, I think I used it once and I probably have two more applications of this. I'm trying to use it sparingly because I haven't gotten the opportunity to go to the store, go to the beauty store to get some more. So, but I do love this. And I think I have, um, that I have been super obsessed with. And now that like, I don't know if you've seen like, I don't know the last video that I was in probably I had really huge, like monstrous eyebrows, but now they're tamed back down because I let my eyebrows go for a while. And I'm so sorry if you had to endure all of that for a while, but now, I I even liked this when my brows was um huge. This is the Elf Small Angled Brush. I got it at Walmart. I can't remember how much I got it for. I couldn't remember. But this is so awesome to do like thin brows. You can do like I did my liner today with it. I mean, it's just bomb.com. Like I love this brush. I'm obsessed. Like if I lose this thing, I go back out and buy like 
three more of them because that is how obsessed I am. Um, makeup product that I love. It's a lip color and this is from the brand Ofra. This is, this did come in my beauty con for fall. Um, but I'm wearing it today. I've been obsessed with this color. Like everybody's been like, I love that color on you. And I'm like, thank you. So let me just swatch it for you. This is in the, um, color mocha. And this is a liquid lipstick, so it does stay on. And I'm telling you, like, I've ate, it didn't come off. Mm -hmm. I drunk drinks, and it didn't come off. I just love this, and I'm super, super. Um, Next is what lashes I would wear on a daily basis if I wasn't filming or anything like that. And that are that is these. They're the Salon Perfect B Naturals. Um, these are amazing, like, they just enhance my natural lashes, and that's all that I need. I need just a little bit of oomph, you know, but I don't need a huge oomph. Like, I'm wearing today these huge-ass ones. Um, these are the bomb, and I love them. And so, the next thing that I got, I have a ton of these, and so I just, um, I can't find any of the actual ones that are out of the package, so I just pulled out one of the new packages that I had, and I have a ton of these because I'm obsessed with these. They're the lit, the chapstick duos. Um, this one's in the, in the flavor of refreshing watermelon and kiwi. And basically they're like snap, like you can snap them together and you can have two different like flavor chapstick. Um, I have one that's like coconut and pineapple. I have one that's peach and vanilla. There's one that's, um, there's other kinds. I can't remember what the other ones were that I have, but, um, basically you can switch out the flavors. Like if you wanted vanilla and strawberry together, you can do that. If you wanted vanilla and coconut together, you can do that. If you wanted peach and, and pineapple together, you can do that. You know, just, you know, you can mix in like, you can use just one flavor or you can do both flavors and just have like a whole little flavor party going on on your lips and next is um <clears throat> are the oily um cleansing wipes these are amazing to get my makeup off um smell really really good trust and believe me i'm obsessed with these like i think this is my second pack that i've gone through in like probably about two weeks <laughs> Um, and I love them. Um, you can get them at Walmart, any drugstore probably. Now, the next product was kind of like, um, a recommendation through another YouTuber. Not personally, but like in one of her videos. And, um, <clears throat> Ashley, Ashley C, she talks about it. She's awesome. Go check her out. Just put Ashley C and she'll pop up. But, um, it's the Olé Oil Minimizing Clean toner with witch hazel anything with witch hazel it got me like when she said it had witch hazel and i'm like girl i gotta go buy that because i don't like my face toner is all witch hazel like that's all it is um and witch hazel is like skincare remedy for anything really um you you can do your research and do you know talk about it but um it smells really good it like like i keep this like with me at all times like i put it in my purse i put it, it i mean i carry this stuff with me everywhere with like a few like cotton rounds because like my face gets oily a lot so i'm just like instead of having oil blot sh blotting sheets and powder i just you know especially because like most of the time I'm not wearing foundation. Now, if I'm wearing foundation, it's a different story. Like, but if I'm not wearing no makeup or I'm just wearing like eyeliner or mascara or something like that, I will just do my whole entire face and just clean it off, make it feel fresh. I mean, like literally this shit just makes my skin look, feel so refreshed and so amazing. Is this dry shampoo from Herbal Essence. This stuff smells freaking amazing. Not only is it good for just getting all the oils out but it helps to protect your hair color which I've never seen in any other I mean probably now but like you know the ones that I've used I haven't seen this but this is the color me happy one and I got this I believe at Walmart but I'm pretty sure you can get it at any drugstore obviously if you can find herbal lessons in a store it's probably there <laughs> Um, so the, obviously this is my holy girl. This is like one of the things that I'm going to probably recommend until I'm probably done with YouTube or dead one. Um, and that is just coconut oil. This stuff is amazing. Not only is it amazing for my hair, it's been like helping to recover my hair from all of the damage from bleaching and dyeing and doing all that bull crap to it. But it's also good for like moisturizing your skin. It's a good like, you know, you can make 
bath bombs out of this. You can make, you know, you can cook with it. You can do all kinds of stuff with it. This is like the stuff that like is in my cabinet at all times, all times. Now let's just get into just random crap. Um, new makeup bag that I'm going to travel with when I go to Florida in the spring. It is, um, let me just tell you a story. This is actually a bag that came with a gift set of Axe, like girly Axe perfume and body wash and loofah. But I don't use the perfume, or I meant the body spray, and but I do use the body wash and a little loofah. But I mean, like, look how freaking huge this guy is. Like, it's huge. And the best thing about it is, is that, like, when you have, like, not a, like mine, my, mine is full, but if it's not full, you can like snap it down and like downsize it. But this guy is definitely going to be traveling with me. Um, when I go to um Florida, unless I can find a bigger one, <laughs> I know, but um, but it was cute because it was white and it had like a really cute pink zipper in it. Um, so the first thing is this this is, um, I think. No, this one's a new one. Um, <clears throat> I actually have one on my phone, which I'm recording on right now with. But this is Temper Glass, but this is from the Dollar Tree. Um, it's it's a little bit more cheaper cheaper made, but like literally, like I've only had to change my um, Temper Glass like once, and that was just because I like had dropped my phone pretty hard, and it was with it was in my otter box so like my phone went broke so don't worry about that but the the glass was bright was cracking and I don't like all that so I just like peeled it off and changed it again but this is amazing like I've had ones that cost 10 20 dollars and they just instantly like shatter and these <laughs> with me they they hold up let me just put it out next I gotta show you these these are so gorgeous um I only picked out the ones um that were my two favorite ones but these fans that I got from the Dollar Tree and I've I put them in a haul which I don't know if you'll see after this or before it but look how pretty these are they're so gorgeous and like what I like to do is like turn these into like little decorations like on the walls and stuff like that but I love Love, love these. These are so pretty. Next two items came from my Mickey Monthly. And the first one is this cute little picture frame. And it's really cute because it's got a magnet. But then you can also, like, if you don't didn't want to put it, like, on a refrigerator or something. But you wanted to, like, you know, sit it on, like, somewhere. You can do that as well. So, I was thinking about putting, like, my kid's picture in here when we go to Disney World. So, that's why there's no picture in it right now. Um, but I thought this was super adorable. Then the next thing I think is super adorable, but I unfortunately on my card don't have an antenna, but it's one of these like antenna decorating decorators things, but it's for Christmas time. I do have a Minnie Mouse one and, and with like, I have another one with Minnie Mouse bow and she's got a, like, she's like a pre present. This one's like a little cookie. I think he's supposed to be cookie. Yeah. He's a cookie. So I'm probably going to just like see if like my mom, or not my mom, but my grandma wants to put one of these on her car for Christmas. She so the next thing um, is something that kind of is more dear to me. I know this is crazy, but it is my planner for this coming year. Actually, it is a planner from that goes from I think like August all the way to August 2016 all the way to I think February 2018. But it is this and it's love and then I don't know if you can see it with the little thing but it says by him and then it's John 316 I'm a you know you know no it's loved I'm sorry it says loved I'm sorry um but what it is is it's a planner look how beautiful that is it's so gorgeous and like I'm just gonna show you some stuff like it's just really really cool like it has like like you can write like things I want to accomplish, which I think is amazing because you know me, I'm always writing a gold list down. So that's perfect. And then like your personal info, which I haven't, I haven't really like actually wrote, wrote in here other than like this week, but I haven't actually wrote into the other stuff, but there's like the metric stuff in here, which I think is cool because like when I'm cooking, I'm like, girl, what is this? Um, there's, um, holidays observe, observe, 
around the world for 2017 and there's a bunch <laughs> um there's like the world time zone and dialing codes which i think is cool and then over here it says wedding anniversary gifts and it's like first second third all the way to like whatever and there's like certain things that like you can like you're supposed to give them for their anniversary like your first anniversary traditional is like paper and then contemporary is a clock i don't um, and then it starts off with like, you know, here's like an inspirational, like words of wisdom. And then you have like goals for the month. And then there's like a little short preview of what the month looks like calendar wise. Oh, it's September, not August. I'm sorry. I told you wrong. But this is like the whole week. And then you can write like appointments, which I like that and birthdays and whatnot. But then there's the individual week. Which I like. You know what I mean? And then, you know, that goes on through February of 2018. No, March of 2018. And then, like, in the back you have, like, your contacts and the birthdays. And there's, like, a little room for, like, notes. Like, tip, you know, traditionals. Oh, there's also, like, for, like, you know, like, different scriptures you can look up for different things. Like, for finances, fear, death, marriage. You know, all kinds of stuff like that is in there. So, I really like it because it's in this, like, leather thing and I can zip it up. Really nice. If I can find one, I'm going to probably get one for my grandmother and probably for maybe my mom. Wish. I'm probably going to show it in a wish haul when I get the opportunity to get all my stuff together, which I'm still waiting on a few items. Sorry, but it takes forever for wish. And if you know the struggle, hey, girl, hey. But, um, this is... Um, I love Batman. I love anything to do with Batman. And, you know, I guess just because Batman is, like, the shit. But this is, like, um, kind of like a double layered. Um, but it's, like, a tank top kind of thing. And then it's, like, off the shoulders with this the, on the black. But it just looks like that. And it's so... Secondly are these pair of jeans. And I actually show this in a haul. I have worn them. But look at the pocket. And I got these at Walmart and they're from the brand Faded Glory. So, and they were in the big girl section. So if you're a big girl, go get you a pair of them. I got some cups, um, this month <laughs> and a water bottle. I got two cups and a water bottle this month. And so the first one that I got was given to me by my brother and it's from Starbucks. It's this like black with the gold glitter. <sighs> I just love this shit. It's it's pretty and it's amazing and I've been drinking like my iced coffee in this and it's, it needs to be washed. But, um, okay. So the second one that I have is this camouflage one. I love camo and it's a nice like stainless steel one and it keeps your like shit so cold. I just have a straw in it because I like to drink out of a straw and I mean this is huge too. Like look how huge this bad boy is. It's like freaking huge I don't know where and then lastly I got this one from Mickey, Ma Mickey Monthly and I was so happy and like it, when you watch the video I, I think I kind of get a little too excited let me just put that way but it's something that I've been wanting forever and it is a water bottle and let me just start off with there's Cruella there's the Queen of Hearts the Evil Queen my favorites which are Ursula and Maleficent them two are together which I thought was awesome but it's a water bottle and I love it and I have actually just my drink sweet tea so so the next thing is with oh my god they're so good um this is from the brand Cracker Jacks which if you know Cracker Jacks you get like a little prize or whatever excuse me but this is the holiday sugar cookie popcorn oh my god this stuff is so good like this is a good sweet but like if you're like wanting something that's like sweet but a little bit salty okay. so if you've seen i think one of my vlogs i showed this and i was eating it and it is these from cheetos they're the sweetos and they're cinnamon sugar puffs they're so good so buttery so good so cinnamon just so amazing these are like another good sweet tooth type of um, of snack I love to eat and like I was so obsessed with these I literally wiped my grocery store and I'm gonna go back to Walmart and wipe them clean too if they still have some more but the next thing 
as a coffee creamer I've been so obsessed with, and that is mm -hmm. the white chocolate um, raspberry from the International Delights. And I've already went through two of these already. And I take this to work and everybody's like, girl, that is so good. That is so good. That is bomb.com. Like, it's good if my employees at my work say that. Okay, so lastly, we've got to do the send of the month. And the send of the month this month is um, a very higher end sort of. And that is the Versace Bright Crystal. Bright Crystal. And this stuff is just, oh, it smells so good. Um, it's a little bit of more of like an older lady smelling. So if you're not like down for that shit, that's okay. You know, you, you can wait until next month to see the next one. Cause I'm pretty sure it'll be another girly girly one, but this is smells so good. And I love it. I got actually this little guy from Scentbird. If you want me to do a video talking about Scentbird, just let me know down in the comment section. I'll totally talk about it. If you want me to, I'll just wait until next month to like talk about it. <laughs> Okay, so that is everything for this month's favorite. I hope that you enjoyed it. Give it a thumbs up if you liked it. If you have any products that you want me to try, just comment down below and I will totally try to look for it and find it. And if I like it, obviously it'll be here. So thanks for watching and don't forget whether you're dressed up, dressed down, you're beautiful. Bye.